Greetings everyone. Manu Patra brings to you the news highlights of 17th January 2023. Starting with the Supreme Court. The Supreme Court has referred the petitions seeking relaxation of the directive to declare 1 km around protected forests as ecologically sensitive zones to be listed before a three judge bench. The court has held that an academic qualification is a valid criterion to differentiate pay scale for different employees even when the nature of the work undertaken by them is more or less the same. The court has dismissed a PIL seeking to bring the office of the chief minister under the purview of the Lokayukta Act of the state of Uttar Pradesh. The court has held that delay in taking possession of land due to pending litigation does not entitle original owner of the land the benefit of lapse under section 24 sub clause 2 of right to fair compensation and transparency in land acquisition rehabilitation and resettlement act 2013 the court has held that if special reasons are made out from the charge sheet and the charge sheet reveals commission of non bailable crime default bail granted to an accused under proviso to section 167 sub clause 2 crpc can be cancelled news highlights from the high courts starting with the delhi high court the delhi high court has directed yashraj films to prepare audio description closed captioning and subtitles in hindi language for the ott release of its upcoming movie pathan to make it accessible for hearing and visually impaired persons The High Court while allowing petitions challenging NHAI's decision to invite fresh bids for collection of user fee at two toll plazas has held that the mere possibility of more money in public contract cannot be the sole criteria for terminating contract especially if the contracts were for fixed periods. The High Court has held that avoidance applications filed under IBC survive even after approval of the resolution plan in cases where resolution plans are unable to account for such applications. The High Court while observing that 108 courts in capital are non-functional for want of public prosecutors has called upon the Delhi government to expedite the process of filling up vacancies of public prosecutors in the capital. News highlights from other high courts in the country. The Bombay High Court while expressing concern regarding lack of space for pedestrians to walk due to various structures on footpaths has directed the state government to inform the court about its policies regarding obstructions on footpaths in Mumbai. The Calcutta High Court has decided a case that had been pending for over 72 years. The case was instituted in the year 1951 on the original site of the Calcutta High Court. The Allahabad High Court has directed schools in Uttar Pradesh to refund or adjust 15% of extra fees charged during 2020 to 2021 academic session when the COVID-19 pandemic forced them to shut towards fees to be paid in the future. This concludes the news for today. Thank you so much.